But a long time NBA scout that I respect, I know knows his stuff. <clears throat> he said he's a cross between Larry Bird and Steve Nash. I said if that <laughs> if that's the case, then this dude's gonna light the league on fire. Tell me about his Luka speed Dark. is slower than rush hour traffic. <laughs> that's my takeaway. I just he doesn't pop athletically. The athleticism that that's a problem. The lack of athleticism. Yeah, it doesn't have it. Doncic at six seven will get exposed for all of the inadequacies that Dirk... He struggled with quick defenders. Dirk's not a great athlete. No. Dirk does have explosive no. quickness, right? No. Dirk isn't physical. No. Well, that's what's going to happen to Doncic. We tend to over-sensationalize European yeah. basketball. He's European, or he's going to be the Dirk. Skip, that's an anomaly. It sounds like you're saying Luka will not be, like, a perennial all-star type player. I don't see that. I'm not saying Luka is setting the NBA world on fire. Mm -hmm. I, I'm not sure he's going to be a dominating NBA player. I don't believe he's a lottery pick. Not a lottery no, pick. No, I don't. Wow. DeAndre Aiden is going to be the number one overall pick, but it's incredibly important that the Phoenix Suns don't mess this up. I don't give a damn about how this kid in Europe looks. I mean, I'm not loving what I'm hearing about Luka then. This kid's a really, I mean, he's better than Ricky Rubio, but he doesn't, sure. look, he doesn't look special to me. I don't see Steve Nash. I definitely don't see that. Back to Doncic. Doncic pulls up, three-pointer. Bang! Bang! It's good! Doncic wins the game at the buzzer! Let's go!